pretty unreal. So just on the right hand side there guys, I'm not sure if you just saw when we And the other mums are uh, just out in front of us really. So those little babies, as you can see, very curious by us. Uh, they don't usually come this close to the boat unless there's good looking people on board. So congratulations guys, you've done well. Unreal. So guys, I'm not sure if you have noticed as they do come alongside of the boat. They actually turn onto their sides. So these dolphins, they can look forwards, backwards, out to the side and down. They can't actually look up. So out. <laughs> oh, no. So do they sleep in water? Yeah. Well, they can't sleep out of the water, can they? It's pretty, pretty cool. Awesome, so we did see a dolphin nap. Now, when they're napping, what they do is they come to the surface and pretty much just pause. Pause there, exposing that blowhole. So they just sit there for three to ten seconds. Now, the really cool thing about these dolphin naps is they actually keep half of their brain awake when they're sleeping. The other half is obviously asleep, but this is for a couple of reasons. They're obviously very vulnerable at the surface of the water from boats and predators, so they're keeping one eye open, watching out for those predators and boats. Also, if they have a little baby, they're going to keep an eye on them as well. So it can learn to take its first breath as a little baby dolphin. So they're nice and close to us here. Um, I believe there was a little calf on the left. I think it's just cruising back over to mum on the right hand side, coming to say hello to us again. <laughs> this is uh, pretty fantastic here. Absolutely sunny. So these little calves will spend about three to six years of their life with mum. So mum does all the upbringing, all the hard work. Uh, for the first part of the little baby's life,